Hi, this is Elizabeth from allthingspaper.com and I'm uh, going to show you real quick a little mini that I made. Uh, it's a combination mini uh, journal and uh, photo album. Kind of combine the two together. I had the idea of beach in, in my head. I actually made a second one for myself to use this summer. I'm going to take pictures of my kids at the beach when we go in uh, July and I thought well, let me get the book all ready and then I I know what to take for picture wise. So anyway this is the second one that I made um, using the same ideas. So anyway real quick um, isn't this cute? I added the window is the Tim Holtz die uh, made out of chipboard and I grunged it up and used some uh, crackle and then I used um, uh, vintage photo on it to make it that old look and then I added these old-time images here in there and that cute and it says here beach house right there so that's the cover the overall size is about three by five uh, maybe a little bigger um, I used my bind it all there's the back and I used this wonderful paper that looks like an old uh, beach old wood kind of um, peeling paint. Isn't that great? So there's the cover and then it's real simple inside. I, I left it pretty pretty simple. Now the inside, isn't that beautiful? I can There's a little bit of glitter right there. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but this is a napkin that I used and applied it. First I gessoed the paper and then I added the, um, the napkin and I did that on the insides of both. Isn't that beautiful? I just love these napkins. And then I added a little sparkle of glitter here on both. So that's the inside covers. And then the pages, there's um, six pages here. Each one is, there's room for journaling. I left them blank. So there's lots of room for journaling and, uh, or you can mount pictures either way. And then each page also has a pocket that pulls out and there's paper. And again, you can mount photos on these or, draw, or uh, write on them. So either way, it works for either a journal or a, a photo album or both. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. So six, six pages. So there's room here for four times, there's room for 24 pictures if you wanted to load it up with pictures. If you used both front and back and the front and back of each tag. So there's plenty of room for pictures. On the back I also included this cute little pocket. I made this in Photoshop and I printed it out on cardstock and then I folded it and put it in. It's a like a little envelope, coin envelope or something. And then in, inside here is a little artist trading card or ATC that I made that I'll include. It's just a blank on the back. And again I use the napkin and this is a um, re reproduction of a watercolor painting that I did. I cut it out of the shell. I've got I paint shells a lot so I use that. And that just goes in here. So that's it. It's very simple. I hope you like it. This is going to be going into the uh, Bliss Co-op in Sugarloaf, New York for sale. Um, I sell my artwork there, my mostly my journals and um, altered objects. So if you're interested, uh, you could visit there if you're in the New York area or email me or post here and I can get in touch with you if you're interested in purchasing this. So thank you very much and have a great day and uh, hope to see you soon at allthingspaper.com. Bye-bye.